In the midst of a difficult year, the British royal family is currently at a major turning point. According to a reliable royal source, the revelation that Camilla is King Charles' illegitimate child has caused considerable excitement in Buckingham Palace. The revelation also has major implications for Prince William, who is set to ascend to the throne sooner than initially expected. Royal insiders say that Queen Camilla has chosen not to respond to these allegations. This silence only increases speculation and uncertainty. An Australian man, Simon Charles Durante, claimed today that he is the son of King Charles and Queen Camilla, who are said to be unable to legally have children. He claims that they became fathers when they were 17 and 18 years old, respectively. The Queen was against many of Prince William's plans, so his announcement is said to have caused great disagreement and complicated his efforts to modernize the royal institution in this tumultuous time. Of course, the dark cloud that King Charles played as a mistress during his marriage to Princess Diana will always haunt her and remain on everyone's lips. Another shocking revelation from her son with first husband Tom Parker Bowles is an explanation of exactly why he and his mother have not always seen eye to eye. Tom says he heard that his mother was thought to be a heavy drinker, especially of gin, and a heavy drinker. It is correct to be a smoker the Queen does not smoke now, but Camilla has been smoking for 30 years The current situation of people recruited from the royal family is an interesting topic The current population of active royals is decreasing, and their advanced age highlights the urgency Prince William's main goal is to streamline operations and reduce the number of royals empowered by the institution. But a source close to Queen Camilla revealed that she is the most vocal critic of these proposals. The new professional royal family members should be given more time to carry out their long-standing responsibilities. Simon Charles Dante's surprise appearance The allegations of the day have further deepened the existing rifts within the family. Shortly after Prince William ordered the removal of the prince, Dante sent a message to Buckingham Palace saying that many people connected to Camilla from the royal payroll have made an already delicate situation even worse. So who is Simon Charles Dante Day? Is he apparently the biological son of King Charles and Queen Camilla? Extensive investigations and a plethora of evidence spanning more than 30 years are now preparing for a possible court battle and legal action will be taken if Charles and Camilla come to Australia in 2024. In an interview with an Australian magazine, Dante Day revealed that his grandmother, who previously worked for the Queen, always claimed he was the biological son of Charles and Camilla. First, he was born on April 5, 1966 in Gosport, Portman, England. The evidence supporting his claim includes several key points. Adoption papers and birth certificates are central in this case. He was adopted by Karen and David Day when he was eight months old, but the hospital listed on his birth certificate is said to have not performed any births there for ten years after he was born. Furthermore, Dante Day believes that the surname listed on his birth certificate is not real. Secondly, his adoptive grandparents have repeatedly supported this claim providing evidence that he is the biological son of Charles and Camilla. Thirdly, Dante Day's research has revealed that Camilla was active in British social circles for at least nine months prior to his birth. During this time, Charles was living in Australia. Dante Day remembers being placed in various homes in Portland during his childhood, where he regularly spent time with the woman he is convinced was Camilla. A legal battle is currently ongoing to obtain DNA evidence to support Dante Day's claims. He remains determined to take legal action to force Charles and Camilla to undergo a paternity test. Some reports have suggested Camilla's reluctance to support Prince William's plans for the monarchy may have contributed to Dante's suspicions.